So I'll start off with my introduction. My name is Karan Shivastav and I'm working as a senior information security consultant with InfoSec Train from the past three and a half years. So over here, my job responsibilities uh, include like we touch multiple cybersecurity verticals. So being it uh, information security, your security testing, uh, your SIM solution implementations, uh, your red teaming, your penetration test, vulnerability assessment. So we look upon a couple of fields over here. So my my job responsibilities are over here like uh, doing a VAPT projects and implementation into various sector. All right. Before working with InfoSec Train, I was working with DRDO, Defense Research Development Organization, as a software developer trainee over there. So I used to develop projects over there, particularly web application projects uh, relatively to internal and external defense applications. So as you can see on the left and on the top of the screen, these are uh, certain certification which I have achieved so far throughout my career path in cyber security multiple certification from ec council vendor being at uh, ch master ecih your uh, ctia threat intelligence SOC analyst lpd license penetration tester and a uh, couple of certification from comtia vendor security plus n plus pentest plus cysa plus and one certification from offensive security as of now that stands out for OSWP offensive security wireless professional. These are some of our international clientele to which we have delivered the training and we have done project implementations. So being at EC Council Masterclass, TWAC Cybersecurity Bootcamp, multiple region of Gulf you will all see out over here, including Central Bank of UAE, Deva UAE, Ministry of Defense Oman, Ministry of Defense India, US Army, UK Army, TNM, Malawi over there, Tanzania Revenue Authority. On the bottom of the screen, bottom left, we have certain courses. These are all official courses that we deliver out, be it in AC Council vendor, SANS, CompTIA, Pearson, couple of certification from there. On the right hand side of the screen, bottom right, these are some custom tailor courses that we deliver out, being it in the field of penetration testing, red teaming, blue teaming, digital forensics, SOC implementations, mobile application security testing, wireless penetration testing, web application security testing, operational security, ICS, SCADA, which is being popular even today. Right. These are some of my technical skills. OWASP top 10, vulnerability assessment, penetration testing, web application security testing, computer forensics, wireless penetration testing. Out of these listed skills, two things are my forte or I would say my specialization. That is web application security testing and wireless penetration testing. Right. And uh, I do hold an academic background with a bachelor's and master's in the field of computer application that stands out for BCA and MCA degree over here. All right. So today we're going to be talking about MITRE and attack framework. Right. So agenda is quite simple over here that we'll be discussing what attack in MITRE is understanding the matrices, tools, techniques, what are those things and guidance on security team on how do we use this thing with your particular logs or anything which you get into your inside organization and you can improve your security posture. All right, just have a look on this link, right? We're going to be using this throughout our session and we'll explore this particular website along with some subdomains over here and we're going to be understanding what this thing is and how we can take this into the consideration. Okay, so before starting up attack in MITRE, anybody of you in the session have any knowledge prior knowledge how this thing is working and why do we implement this attack and monitor into the corporate environment. So first of all, uh, like the we, if we go ahead with the attack and monitor full form over here that stands out for adversarial tactics, technique and common knowledge looks like a repo over here. Right attack we are talking about MITRE corporation is there right so MITRE corporation. They introduced this thing to us adversarial tactics technique and common knowledge. All right, if we talk about this particular thing, let's talk about first your cyber kitchen mythology. Right. 
So first of all, like if we talk about, we'll come to cyber kitchen mythology. I'll keep this aside and I'll keep this into consideration in just another two minutes over here, right? So let's have a discussion over this thing again, my turn and attack, my turn and attack, how this framework and how this mythology come into the picture. All right. First of all, it's not at all a new framework. It's not at all a new framework. We are studying up over here in 2020 and no. It was there last year also before that year also, and there are a couple of release or updates that have been already made to maintain an attack since the day it has been released, right? It has been already released in the year May, 2014 main thing, right? Now they came up with this thing, but how they evolved this thing. Cool. So what they did is miter and attack corporation. If you talk about miter and attack. If you talk about they came this concept with us military over here okay so they have a methodology which is known as f2 t2 ea now what is this right we need to understand this thing what is this part kill chain whenever we are talking about correct it already came up into world war ii this was the thing that was military kill chain f2 t2 ea one military key chain this is known as this thing find the enemy right find identify the target fix fix the target location track all right target engage and access right this was the stuff and one more thing was there along with this you can see the links in the chat box we have four f's that was used by the united states military in the world war ii which is known as find the enemy fix the enemy fight the enemy and finish the enemy all right what does lockhead martin did this organization right so when we talk about this cyber kill chain mythology there is always a keyword which comes in our mind that is lockhead martin organization all right, they came up with this concept cyber kill chain mythology, right? So he used that US military concept World War II into cyber kill chain mythology over here, right? So what happened over here? We always study these things. Okay, just have a look around this thing. We know a couple of people already know just going ahead with what we are studying up over here. It's known as like reconnaissance, weaponization, delivery, exploitation, installation, command and control and action on objectives. Reconnaissance, like everybody know, like we have footprinting over here or you done in many general step, we can say it's nothing but your information gathering. Gathering up the information for a corporate, it's not a big deal. We are generally look for, looking for two things, organization or people, right? So we want to get an email for the corporate, no issues in that. Weaponization, coupling the exploit with the backdoor into deliverable payload. For example, people say like we want to create a FUD. FUD means fully undetectable and you want to send it throughout the email. So here your email, it will be your delivery method, right? But you're weaponizing it, so weaponizing it like you are sending some beacon, maybe it's using some tool or your manual method. You're creating something which is undetectable by the AVs antivirus and your endpoints all right so method you use like spear phishing or you you are using the email method over there no issues exploitation anybody who downloads the document it can be a pdf or a macro enabled document and you download this stuff exploitation will start on your system installation installing malware on the asset meaning it will go to some interesting location maybe the platform is linux or windows so in case of windows it will go towards your prefetch file your temporary files apart from your system 32 because that's a very common place all right or you create a shortcut you create a link file or you create a companion file so let's suppose you're launching calculator.exe something happens in the background and it will stay there for a longer period of time this is nothing but we are saying apt all right, command and control, which is just making a connection to the outside world, internal to internal communication, external to internal communication. All right, and we talk about this thing, which is your action on objective, which is nothing but your goal will be achieved over here. All right, so now this concept we will bring upon with attack in miter framework. Okay, let's see how before moving over there. Let's talk about this thing. Three keywords written over here, which is your adversarial tactics, technique and common knowledge. Common knowledge, no problem that considered to be in repo over here. Adversarial tactic and technique. What is adversary? It is not advisory. It is adversary. I repeat again. It is adversary, not advisory. In a very simple layman term, we can keep it for a longer period of time. It is nothing but known as opponent. Consider this thing is your opponent, right? And a very real time example I would take up over here. Like we all know Batman character and the opponent is nothing but your Joker. 
simple enemy you can say right so in the whole series they all are fighting and it is happening right tactics technique and common knowledge over here right although we call this particular thing over here as ttps okay step by step tactics technique all right tactics is nothing like you can say initial intrusion exploitation the things which we have just learned so far in the cyber kill chain you can consider those things as tactic and you will see with me all right techniques there are more hundred for more than 400 techniques over there how do we do it example it can be an execution of your windows dll file it can be an attack like hot potato or juicy potato or maybe mouse jack attack over there is possible with windows ad environments right procedure is what thing you will follow with it maybe you are using encrypting the payload you are using uh, step by step things what what things you will do next if this execution is failing what is the next thing will be triggered in the system right so these things we have to talk about correct reason why we are studying up all these things because this thing is little bit disturbing in the environment reason there is only one reason threat attribution is one thing which is very difficult to do i'm again writing threat attribution right because the new things that comes to you you don't know what to do with it right so we combine and they update also but we cannot say 100 percent things are possible with attack and miter okay we can use at both of the side you can use it to understand the attack how they are coming to you and you can use it to build your defensive strategy also because you know what is coming what will be the expected next step they will follow and you can defense yourself over there okay so coming to the website everybody can open this thing in any of the browser there is no issues in that and we're going to be using this website over here okay so attack in miter as you can see this orange ribbon over here we call it so it has couple of tabs over here which is matrices tactics techniques mitigation groups software resources blog and contribute we'll be going for the entire series over here all right and we see one by one what happens over here as soon as we go over here we see matrices which we landed up over here and over here we are saying up that we have matrices for windows mac os linux cloud network as per the need more things will be coming for sure on the left hand side everybody can see enterprise matrix is one of the metrics which is mostly used reason being because enterprise matrix covers a lot of techniques and tactics over here reason being you will see most of the environments like windows mac os linux right you have aws google cloud azure azure ad office 365 sas network all these things are there cool if i look at this thing guys if i look at this thing everybody just have a look around i'm just zooming out over here and focus on this area everybody can open the link which i just pasted in the chat right now how does it look like is it looking like your cyber kill chain yes or no exactly it looks like that <clears throat> right sorry for it reconnaissance is there execution is there persistence is there privilege escalation defense evasion credential access discovery lateral movement or you call it like post exploitation no issues collection command and control c2c was exactly there in the cyber kill chain as well data exfiltration and the impact these things are going correct these things we call as tactics over here first thing clear it is clear with me everything ttps the entire line should be clear to you the things which you see over here these are techniques and the sub techniques so the one which is showcasing you a pipe symbol or you can see an or symbol over here in the regex expression we call it so everything will be over here techniques and sub techniques correct last month it got updated this month also it got updated and couple of things has been changed from there november 8 we remember over here before that sub technique was not coming individually now categorization is more because it has been adapted by a lot of solutions right now in the industry you talk about most of the sims with the ti and attack in miter is famous over there for sure right so we'll be taking out an example and we'll be using this in one of the ticket in front of you as an example that how we can use this stuff to gain our knowledge okay so we don't have to go with each and every technique and we have to talk about but yes if we know it's a very plus add-on over here 
okay we have couple of matrices regarding your mobile android and ios sorry windows mobile is not there right and the kai os which we generally use in your those button phones okay the old era phone that is not there kai os we are using it over here ICS industrial control system they implement this thing they all together introduce a proper car also for behaving in a manner that it will be providing you and protecting you from couple of threat which is physically happening physical hack is also there right a proper car right it's not car car is uh, there is adversarial uh, project which is all, also over here car a proper car they have a miter car they have made over here all right so these things we'll be talking about tact you can talk about enterprise let's go over there total 14 tactics over here 14 cool so we'll be talking about and each of the tactic have a tactic id cool zero one zero five at least we can remember this one because these are lesser in number okay so only 14 are there and you can say reconnaissance resource development this is for those people who doesn't know anything about the attack in monitor and the tactic which is a new thing for you someone may be in the management you can easily understand these things what are the meaning of this stuff okay techniques you go techniques we can again open for the enterprise there are 348 plus 177 more than 450 techniques in total we have and each technique <clears throat> sorry for it have a id over here which is t1548 okay let's suppose this one then you will write dot zero zero one dot zero zero two like this when you're solving up any scenario over here t1134 we are using this thing so we don't have to remember again there is a way that you can search up all these things there's a tactic for it all right mitigation is also there let's suppose we talk about mitigation mitigation also have an id but only 42 mitigation because it's an ongoing thing right whole attack in monitor framework it's an ongoing we cannot say it's a stable product but yes most of the things are represented over here and they keep on updating it okay groups when we talk about so we have something over here which is your apt groups all right so we have apt1 apt12 apt16 all these things are there total 109 apt groups correct no issues software is also there software how it will help you because in the pen testing red teaming or we talk about defensive blue teaming tools and softwares are being everywhere used we can talk about metasploit framework mimicat right windows utility your cmd commands are there ip config if config net start arp hyphen a task list sc query net group domain group any kind of things will be there so how do we find this thing and map it with this particular framework correct so we have defined a software id and this is generally divided or given as sid generally right it is not the security id as a that of windows but yes each software let's suppose we talk about mimicats let's talk about that okay so whosoever is like new to it this is nothing but a credential dumping tool and we have an id to it s0002 type tool platform everything is written cool no issues in that right coming over to the group guys again so group i just want you all to go ahead with apt3 and apt29 as of now just for it and give me a quick explanation for apt3 and apt29 so guys this is like attack vector spear phishing okay spear phishing is there your backdoor zero day attack attack vectors these are there attack region is eastern asia and north america in terms of apt3 okay in terms of apt3 this is happening all right let's talk about apt29 as well over here apt29 if you are talking about apt29 is most focused with the russian state and they are attempting and stealing the data from academic and pharma institutes okay according to the researchers like various attempted breach have been happened in us and asia and you are right the attack pattern is quite same attack pattern is quite same correct now if these things are happening and let's suppose you are finding a tool a software to be landing up into two categories which is apt3 and apt29 let's suppose if you want to make a comparative relation or any judgment from these two apts how are we going to do let's see over the screen all right attack and matrix this matrix guys let's customize this one let's customize this proper thing over here i'm sharing your link this is your attack and miter navigator people are using this with automation as well there is no problem right now we are learning the manual method okay so let's go ahead and create out a new layer over here let's go ahead and create with enterprise 
Okay, everybody, you first see, I'll give the time, you can perform the same action onto your screen as well. Okay, so we, you choose the enterprise matrix and a new layer over here. I'm just defining over here on the top, over here on the top, I will mark whatever I do. I repeat, I will mark whatever I do. I am just changing over here my name to APT3. Just carefully focus. We're gonna discuss each and every option over here. Let's go ahead. So we're gonna be having the first option over here as you're locking the layer. If you want to lock and if you want to select only tactics or technique, you can lock that particular stuff. We can search. If you want to search for a technique, let's suppose fishing over here. No issues in that. You can search and you can select that one. You can select all. No issues in that. Okay, that depends on the infra and the property which you are searching for. Right now, I'll be going for a multi select and I will select my APT3 over here. And you all can see the things will be highlighted like this. Again, I am drawing with my yellow highlighted marker over here. So have a look. Okay, these stuff are there. And you can see these square boxes are coming up over here. Only these APTs will be selected. All right, everyone clear in that? Now it is a time to create some distinguished thing over here. Next option is if you want to deselect all the technique, 40 technique, just deselect, no problem. Okay, you want to give some information to this layer, you want to give APT3 the name I have already given over there, any description, domain version, you can add, no problem. Right now, just I have selected, only I have bulk selected my APT3 over here. Nothing else I can deselect, I can select, no issues in that. Okay, so let me start again, no issues in that. So let me create a new layer quickly and let me start with APT3 over here right and i'll do a bulk select over here and i'll select with apt3 cool so right now this is the first layer i'll create another layer and the last layer will create only whatever we need only it will be highlighted okay i'll make this thing clear to you next option what we had over here is to download as a json format if you want to export this thing and import it to any other platform all right next thing is your excel if you click on it like it will be saved into an excel file whenever you need it to read or you want to change. This is a SVG image, highly quality image, scalar vector graphic over here, no issues. And you can sort the things if you want to deselect whatever you want to do. So Mr. Mohammed, this is one option that you can filter out as per your environment, you all can use this thing. Ascending, descending order, okay. And let's figure this problem. So now it will be highlighted. I'll be using the gray color for all my tactics, which I already shared with you in the cyber kill chain part. We have a low value as one and we have a high value as three. Cool, low value one, high value three. You can change the colors to whatever you want. We don't have any trouble. You can add more than three colors. We don't have any trouble, but consider, consider I have added three by default three colors are there so first one is going to be using the red one second color is going to be used as a yellow part and third one is going to be used as your green part cool now what we do is I'll give a score to this particular thing which is one I believe now like a couple of things are being highlighted over the screen and this looks clear to which we are focusing upon it has already selected only those things which we are doing up cool i'll make this clear as much as possible with you okay so this is the first thing that i did correct second thing let's create apt 29 right now we are comparing apt 3 and apt 29 because you already said to me that both are using the same tactics in the same methodology how will you make a difference or how you will say what are the common tactics or techniques happened over here okay so that is the reason we give you can give 10 colors we have no issues it has to be the value from 1 to 10 so consider something if you are using a regular expression or you are using any kind of uh, addition over here so whatever combination whatever output you have the final layer is going to have that color with you otherwise how will you distinguish everything will come in white white things all right so let us complete, let us complete, we'll come to a point for sure guys, all these things will be clear to you very nicely. Just consider this thing, right now we are giving zero, uh, sorry, as one and as three over here, right? Let's complete this part and I'll give you guys time, have a play around with this, okay? So second layer, I give this APT29 
name okay exactly same stuff going to the color first one gray you can set it anything one two three same color no issues in that same color i'm giving right and over here i am selecting apt 29 let's select apt 29 from here done 27 tactics uh techniques have been selected not the tactics techniques let's give this thing a layer as core as two you remember one was red two was yellow and if i make a comparison or a combination over here it's going to be a green one correct creating a third layer right now creating layer from other layer third option i'm choosing again zooming the screen create layer from another layer as soon as you choose this stuff you'll be having a and b cool now what we can do with this a and b a little knowledge of regex expression is required from here from everybody and we can learn the same thing what are the methods or operators it is being using using this link in the chat okay the link is over here i will just highlight where it is right so you can see right now the same stuff which we used to study very way back in the colleges and in the school bot mass rule you see okay 2 multiplied by 3 plus 4 so first of all braces will be solved bracket open multiplication addition subtraction and it is being multiplied with this thing we can combine there is no problem object you can use no problem operator you can use there is no issues the thing is we have to learn a little bit of regex over here which is required in this stuff little bit not much okay so i'll give you the link where you can practice and you can become a very in like low to at least intermediate level very nicely in a week or two with the expressions okay so here it is a plus b i'm just giving i'm just giving see the enterprise matrix attack v8 is version 8 which is the latest stuff version 7 version 6 version 5 it can go back also sometime what happen like environment is a little bit old you will not be able to find every technique or tactic over here okay so in that case we'll be using this part cool so a plus b i'm just doing an addition over here whatever common things comes out it will get it for me okay so i'm doing this thing and let's create now this is the final matrix i would say or i will say this is the combined layer right now you all can see this thing is coming yellow this thing is coming red and the combined things which are common in both of them it is coming out to be this it is coming in one also it is coming in two also that means apt3 apt29 correct these things are coming common first thing if you want to highlight something you want to say okay this is you want you want to add a comment to your team like this is important we can have this thing also over here and let's export this stuff and save this part okay and let's open this thing and let's see how does it look like in excel okay so whenever you are reporting this thing we can use this part and it will be good for us just for the understanding i would say right and on the basis of this whatever common things are there whatever the next thing expected thing which is coming to you we can build some defense strategies at least you understand okay this this thing is happening with us and it is common in apt3 also 29 also and other apts also you have to use some more expressions over there regex expression and you will be getting the result in front of you okay this is one usage this is one usage of it another usage also of the attack in miter framework i'll give you okay all right i guess uh, you get a fair idea guys all of you right so let's go ahead with one more implementation over here this is just for the comparative uh, things all right let's go ahead with one more stuff and uh, we'll be talking which one i have to select in the multi select mr musaddik it is like we are talking about right now uh, apt3 and apt29 okay so what we have and how do we use it very simple guys what you need to do you search for any command any tool over here in this search it will take time no issues in that but it will tell you at least in which category it is falling under it is falling under apt3 apt29 it is having under which technique which sub technique this thing it will tell you okay and at least this thing we can mention up while we are solving up any kind of solution or you got in a position or you got a tool in your logs where you have no idea powershell command no problem in that you can write the command sch task over here also you can write there is no problem in that okay so let's take the advantage of uh, one of the take it over here so i'm giving you guys one link please go through it please go through it okay i'm just giving you allow me a moment just sharing with you we'll all be learning together over here this is the link everybody 
okay so go ahead go ahead and download there is something which is ticket 473822.rtf cool this ticket will look something like this everyone on the screen this ticket will look something like this you all can download and you can just understand this thing i am opening over here holding my screen also for a couple of minutes or a couple of seconds over here what we have to do in this thing we'll all just take the first five commands just take the first five commands everyone okay you all have to do what let's suppose it is ip config slash all okay let's suppose it is ip config slash all arp hyphen a we are already familiar with this command what does these things doing in the windows environment echo username task list is there you can see slash v entire thing is there sc query system info only first five we have to take guys because we are short with the time so first five commands will take up okay what you all have to do when you take up this command and these are executed on one of the breach head box or you can say one of the jumper box over here and pineapple rat is the remote access trojan which is executing and you are getting this command to be collected from the sysmon server okay these happened these are already happened okay so this is a proper ticket and internet ticket which is there in front of you no logs nothing only you know these things are being carved as an artifact okay so first five commands everybody what you have to do for these stuff only for this okay just search it up just search it up and you have to give them a tactic or a technique in which technique it is falling under okay and one important thing i'll tell you you cannot take the decision yourself what you will write in the report it needs a tabletop exercise for sure every analyst every security engineer every cyber security person have a different mentality your answer will vary over here i can challenge you right now right away at this particular point of time okay ip config slash all you can share like tactic or technique which things you get it is falling under which according to this particular scenario because it was executed and collected from the sysmon so the problem over here like you can say these are the answer right which we are talking about over here these are certain answers right i believe so i believe so execution can be there in everything am i right, right. so all these things common things are coming we can add this thing there is no problem cool the tactic id or technique id may vary over here reason being because this answer might have been taken from the another version of my turn attack right now it is v8 if you want to get the correct answer exactly same answer you have to use v6 version over there on your screen then you will get the exact same answer otherwise your answer may vary okay second thing mr musaddiq you are getting network services scanning okay somebody will say karan i will get something else correct there is no problem you can define more than two techniques over here there is no issues but it has to be relatable with the environment or the security infra which you are being talking about right so again you i am again and again saying answer may vary 100% over here the reason being because everyone have a different mentality you will take it in another way no issues at the end we have to talk about your tabletop exercise over here alone discussion is not allowed okay this answer will vary guys whatever i am sharing with you this answer can vary reason being because this is as per v6 matrix this is not v8 matrix answer may vary over here right right now we are directly doing it but to be very frank there is a process to reach up over here right now if you talk about the steps if you talk about the steps over here so whenever we talk about a process okay so there are total five steps over here first of all like you want to gather the data from raw material or it is from a finished report there is a pyramid of pain that we need to understand what is the iocs that you are getting hash is there or not correct then you have to map this thing portable test decision you have to map this thing whenever we are talking about this mapping exactly this mapping i'm talking about there are five steps over there some recommendations are there from the attack and monitor corporation that which five steps we should follow like you should conduct an analysis there should be a reference there should be a research against the target 
there should be a proper understanding of the situation and then you can filter out from your finished report or from your raw logs also so let's suppose you have a raw log and let's suppose you have a finished report which i just showed you right now that's not a raw log in the raw log what you will do and you will highlight everything let's suppose you get you have a log from a sim solution let's suppose you have and you are getting directory traversal you will highlight you will write this is the directory traversal and we are going to use like this okay you will write the corresponding technique or the tactic id as per your choice more than one tactic or technique id you can use okay then automation comes up like you can talk about like we use this thing for threat hunting also ttps on attacking active directory atomic red team automation canary whenever we are talking about a project there is a project which talks about the automation caldera is one of the project which stimulate your cyber adversary emulation system but it has a very restricted attack over there so what all tactics which we have studied the 14 tactics which we have studied in comparison with the cyber kill chain methodology it is used over here and you just have to select from the drop down and you just have to execute so that any blue teamer will understand what kind of emulation is there okay so these things are over there in the attack and monitor and we talk about these things to be very frank in the training only okay so that's the session just to have an overview how you can use this thing but as of now we have seen two implementation with you today which is nothing your attack and monitor navigator where you can use any two threat actors or threat groups in order to have a comparative thing and what you get in the end is you get the common values in both of them which is used by both of them okay and second thing the implementation like you can get a finished report or you can get a raw log and how you can map this thing with the attack and miter framework all right so these two things are there cool i believe everything is fine right so it was a very enjoyable session with you guys yeah, i got a very interactive audience over here and i would request you you can transfer this knowledge to your entire team and keep upgrading yourself as well and stay safe everyone so thanks for all joining and devoting your time over here over the screen thanks all for attending